Located about 60 kilometers south of Somali capital Mogadishu, this forward operating base in Bariri town has been handed over to Somali security forces. Since 2019, it has been under control of peacekeepers from Uganda and serves as buffer zone for the capital. While officially handing over the base, Atmis officials said the move is part of cooperation between the Somalis and international peacekeepers. This transfer is not just a transfer of, phys of physical assets, but it symbolizes the progress we have made together in our shared mission. And I want to say that together we will continue to work towards a brighter future for Somalia, one, one built on cooperation and the mutual respect and the common goal of lasting, finding a lasting peace. Officials are confident that the Somali security forces will continue to secure the agricultural town and surrounding areas from Al-Shabaab attacks. The handover of this FOB signifies the willingness and capacity of the SNAF to take over the security of Somalia, while admins takes a back seat in a supporting role. I am confident that the SNAF will continue to hold this position and ensure the safety and security of the inhabitants of Barire town. Security analysts are concerned there will be security vacuum after the full withdrawal of Atmis forces from the country. But the Somali government is confident that the national forces are capable of maintaining law and order. African Union peacekeepers have been in Somalia since 2007. You came as brothers and share with us with your bloods. Uh, come and die in Somalia in order for Somalia to become freedom and a future uh, peaceful. And that is not uh, what everybody can do. And uh, it is written aside in our heart the way you treat us as, as a brother. EU forces are expected to exit Somalia by the end of this year. As the drawdown continues, the next six months will be crucial in maintaining the progress made over the past 17 years. Hamid Kahi, CGTN, Mogadishu, Somalia.